Uber driver and a mom of six has a warning after she says two passengers tried to carjack her and then shot at her several times. Thank you for being with us tonight. I'm Ann Allred. And I'm Mike Bush. The shooting happened earlier this month on St. Cyr Road in the Riverview neighborhood of St. Louis County. Our Justina Cornell sat down with the now former Uber driver and Justina joins us in studio. Well, that woman asked to hide her identity since the two suspects are still on the run, but she still wanted to share her experience for others to be cautious. I was just shaking. I, I think my body's been shaking since that moment. Shaken from the shock. That's why this former Uber driver stays anonymous to protect herself from two suspects who took her sense of security. They had me go down this like kind of dead end type of road. Um, it ended at like a metal factory. On October 4th, she said she picked up two young men in the Riverview neighborhood who then tried to carjack her in the middle of the day. For security, she also had a gun underneath her seat. I stopped. They had a gun. Um, it freaked me out. I started like to pretend to get out. So I opened my door, reached down for my gun and um, the one of the passengers freaked out, so they got out. They went to the back of the car. They shot a lot of bullets straight at me. My headrest <laughs> saved my life, uh, catching two bullets in it. My seat has more. The windshield in front of me had four, four holes through it. I didn't even realize at the time, I guess my, my body was just, my mind was shutting off. Her car is riddled with bullets in the memory of that day. It's just scary. A job's not worth losing your life. It's not. She's without a car and a job and faces a mounting financial hurdle. She said Uber hasn't helped either. I don't want this to happen to somebody else. I don't want them to be stuck with all of these bills and no job, no car, and to go through all of this, to to have the, the images of being shot at go through your head a thousand times in a day, and I, I just can't stop thinking about it. This near-death experience reminded her she's grateful to be here. The shooting was just nearly two weeks before her daughter's wedding. I'm happy that I at least get to be there to see my baby get married. <laughs> Now, Uber sent a statement saying, quote, what this driver went through is a nightmare. We have spoken with her to offer support and will continue to assist law enforcement with their investigation however we can, end quote. Now, right now, there's a GoFundMe set up to help the mom of six. In order to help, you can head to our website, ksdk.com, and go to the section, A Scene on TV.